CIA Director John Brennan apologized today after an internal investigation determined the agency had spied on staff members of the United States Senate, something Brennan had long denied. More on that now from Bob Orr in Washington. It's the spies versus the Senate. In January, the CIA accused Intelligence Committee staffers of improperly accessing classified files while investigating the CIA's harsh interrogations of al-Qaeda prisoners. Senators fired back, accusing the CIA of spying on the committee's investigators. An allegation CIA Director John Brennan flatly denied. As far as the allegations of you know, CIA hacking into you know, Senate computers, nothing could be further from the truth. I mean, we wouldn't do that. I mean, that's, that's, that's just beyond the, the, uh, you know, the scope of, of reason. But the CIA's own Inspector General determined the agency did spy on Senate investigators. IG findings released today revealed five agency employees improperly accessed committee files and reviewed some of the emails of committee staff members. In addition to his apology, Brennan ordered a broader internal review. On Capitol Hill, Senate Intelligence Chair Dianne Feinstein said in a statement, these are positive first steps. This IG report corrects the record. Now, all of this is preliminary to the main event. The committee's long-awaited report on the interrogation program itself is expected to be released in the next week or so. And James, it's expected to be highly critical of the CIA's actions after 9-11. Bob Orr in our Washington News Bureau, thanks.